Welcome to Kids Playing. I'm Jared. And I'm Peyton. And today I'm going to teach you how to play Code on the Brink. Code on the Brink is a single player game that helps you learn the basics of coding, like computer coding, but in a hands-on game. You're not actually coding a computer, but it teaches you the concepts. In the game, you have to program your robot to make it move from the beginning of the course to the end without going off the path. The game includes 40 game challenges, ranging from beginner to expert, the control panel, movement cards, and the robot. You have to use the movement cards to program the robot to make it move a certain direction when it stops on a certain color. All the game boards except the expert ones tell you which cards to use, and for the first 10 challenges, you only use the red and blue control panels. To program the robot, you put movement cards in the control panel. These cards tell the robot what to do when it stops on a square that is the color of one of the control panels. If you put two cards on the control panel, the robot does the moves back to back, but always in the same order, left to right. The robot has to stay on the path at all times. If your code leads it off the path, you have to go back and start over, and you can't change the code in the middle of the path. The code has to work correctly from start to finish. So in the first challenge, I used three move forward cards and three X cards. There's no yellow squares, so two of the X cards can go on yellow. If I only put one move forward on blue, then when I move the robot using it, I'll go onto a white square. And since none of the control panels are white, I'm stuck here, so I have to start over. So I need two move forwards on blue and one move forward on red, plus an X, because nothing else can go on it. So now I start and I move forward two spaces, land on a red, then every time I land on a red square, I move forward one space, and I make it to the finish line. That was a really easy challenge, so let's just take a look at one more. On the second challenge, I need to use three X's, two move forwards, and one turn left. And if you look closely, the robot starts pointing away from the path. So I have to make it turn and then move off the square. So I'm going to program the robot to turn left and then move forward when it hits a red square, and then to move forward one space on blue squares, which will lead me to the finish. And that's Code on the Brink. It's a really fun puzzle game, but it also teaches really valuable skills about the basics of coding. If you want to get this game so your kids can start to learn, you can find a link in the description. Let us know in the comments if you played this game or have any other resources to help kids my age learn to code. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. See you later. Bye!